just so tired. God, I'm nervous. Casa, say good morning. Whoa! Thank you so much. So many men being men. I may have had a cry this morning. I was like, you shut up! Shut up! I'm so tired. I'm so, I have to keep my onesie on because I couldn't bear to take it off. I'm just so tired. Oh my god, how cute is that? Yeah, big fat accounting today. Big fat accounting day. It's, I think it's nine days now until the 5th of April. So I need to send all my stuff in ASAP. Because I need my next year of tax if I want that house. So I need to get my shit together. There was some sort of ridiculous, ridiculous, unexpected thing that happened. Uh, and now I need, now I need a third year. So that's great. But luckily the people, the house owners were happy to wait. Very luckily for me. Because that could have ruined the whole thing. I'm late, obviously, as usual. I was supposed to be there at 10, it's 20 past 10 now. I've let him know, I've let him know. I'm going in to see my accountant to give him everything in person and to go through it so we can get it done as fast as possible. Do you know how many hundreds of pages I've just had to print off? Hundreds, hundreds. It's disgusting, I couldn't imagine being an accountant like looking through all the numbers all day. Oh, even just doing it last night, I was Ugh. I was at my accountant's for one and a half hours. It's not a very colorful place in there either. I don't know how they do it. I would literally be, oh God, I just find it depressing. Um, But I've handed in what I can uh, and now, got a bloody dentist appointment in Cheadle because I want to just see with them about the composite thing because even if I don't get a little bit of, and I mean like two teeth composite then there's some uh, staining on my teeth that I want to cover anyway so <sighs> it's just a shame they couldn't fit me in tomorrow because my nail appointment's really near Cheadle and my nail appointment's tomorrow so that means I'm having to go there today and there tomorrow, which is a waste of my time. Five minutes late to my dental appointment. Classic. Sorry, I didn't film an awful lot. Well, it wasn't an awful lot to film. Right, I'm getting composite at the end of it. it they're only going to look like my teeth, right? It's very subtle things that I'm getting changed. Just something that I'll notice. And I won't, I hopefully won't look any different. <laughs> Oh, it's hard to explain that. Why would you want to spend that money if it's, no one else is going to notice? I mean, they're my teeth. They're for me to look at. But also, in this job, you're just looking at yourself all the bloody time. So even if it is some sort of thing that no one else is going to notice, I just see it. I have to edit my face all day. Like, as in, like, video editing, not, like, you know, changing my face editing. But you just notice things, right? I'm just getting it done. No one's ever... And the... They're gonna look natural, they're gonna look like me. <sighs> they're not gonna look like horse teeth in some mad straight line. They're gonna be the same, okay? And then that means then they'll be perfect for when I get my tooth gems put on and my retainer made and just, then we're done, okay? Then we're done. I'm going home now and I'm going to bloody, <laughs> I got Jake pendulum tickets, he really wanted them. I don't think I realised. I think they've had a change of genre in music. I think they used to be quite a bit different to what they are now. Now I, I've seen a video and I think they're kind of like some heavy shit. So I'm a bit nervous and I'm, I'm kind of dreading it. I think it might be like all screaming and stuff. Which don't get me wrong, I don't mind a bit of music like that. I don't. Don't mind a bit of the heavy stuff but when you don't know them, it's a bit harder, isn't it? Like when you go to a band you don't know, it's like, oh, you know, you can just kind of bob about. If you're going to some like screaming gig where you don't even know the music, it's a bit harder. And I'm not even drinking because I'm driving us. We are gonna go to full beforehand though, so I'm, you know, I'm gonna make a nice, I'm gonna have a nice time, I'm gonna have a nice time. I'm ready. God, I hope it's okay. I didn't really know what to wear because I wanted to wear a jacket, I don't want to be cold walking around. Oh God, I'm nervous. I've gone for quite casual. I've worn this Supreme jacket that I've actually barely worn. I should wear it, it's nice. And I've got a little cami top on that says, 
this is a cry for help very fitting no no you know what it might be it might we might have a great time i i like listening to tarantula's one of my favorite gym songs so if they play that one i'd be very happy i'm just really concerned that it's all going to be a bit too angry and i'm not in the mood and i don't know the songs and it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun <laughs> My favourite dragon fruit lemonade, and then we got crispy squid and chicken wings. Our favourite. Wait. One yeah, of our favourite. One of our favourite after <laughs> Well, we found a parking spot at least, but I'm nervous. Do you know why I'm so nervous? Because I watched. I'll see if I can find the TikTok. I'll insert it. But it was like what pendulum used to be like versus what they're like now. It might, it might be a great night, it might have an amazing time. Why does it look so friendly at the minute? I thought it was gonna... Oh, right, there's the darkness through there. How odd, I've never known this before. You can go upstairs. And you can look upstairs, we've got a little TV. I mean, I, we can't see... Well, not that we need to see, but... We've got a VK, because everything else was like 12 pounds. Someone put a lemonade, 12 pounds, it's not a, it's not a fucking cocktail! Rock on! Come on, lads, 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 don't miss It was actually good. It wasn't like what I thought it was going to be like. It was... You saw one TikTok it, in no, Egypt. I thought one tick. No, I saw... No. That TikTok was misleading because it made it seem like the whole thing was going to be screaming. But to be fair, I quite enjoyed the screaming bits anyway. So, yeah, I had a nice time. Yeah. Especially to sell. And driving was so good because we got to park right outside in the Premier Inn. The yeah, a fiver. And there's only like two spots left because I've got a plunky little car I could get in it. We had fun, didn't we? It was good. I when? loved it. You loved not, it? Not quite the same as the first time I went, but... Yeah, but we had fun. The sound was poor. Tarantula the sounded... The warehouse is a shit hole. Tarantula sounded better in my airpods than I did words. there. It was, I could hear myself talk yeah. and... Yeah, I could hear you talk. We had a nice time. Good morning. Carter, say good morning. He's angry because he wants to go out. He's been huffing and puffing. Uh, no, we had a nice time last night, we did. And I've got leftover focus, I never eat, I barely even touch it because I'm, I'm always full of the starter, so I get to eat that for my dinner. Take the schnauzer out, I've got a load of editing to do, need to get my vlog posted and my other video. And then, I've got my nail appointment, thank God, because that, these are bad. I did what I could, but they're not good. I really did try last week to make it less than 40 minutes and it is by about 20 what 35 seconds don't even know i just i think maybe i was just born to make 40 45 minute vlogs they always seem to land on that and i don't try just how they always land i don't know four and a half minutes that was right two and a half that's fine five and a half oh and then it started to go downhill from there Try again next week. What in the fucking Lord's name is that for a shit? Bloody bust mattress. Oh my god, I found it. <laughs> the red nose day grommet mug that I wanted. <laughs> As if I don't have enough stupid mugs. I've made it my little plan now because Jolie can only do nails from five. So when I set off to get there at five, get stuck in a load of traffic. So I go an hour early and go to TK Maxx, which is right by it. And just look for crap like usual. I got this. Whoa, look at this vase. I think that's so interesting. Oh. 
And then I couldn't help it. I had to get the wallet, the grommet mug. I just think that's so cute. It was a tenner though, but it's all for charity. It's fine. And then, oh, this is a bit, I nearly didn't get this, but then I was like, yeah, I do really like that as a random little accessory. I like, it's got the theme of the home. So it's neutral, plain, bang, pop of color. That is the house um, in one item. And then this, it was in the clearance. I just thought dead cute, this little pot. It was only four quid. Love, anything Sicilian style, I'll have it. I just went for plain red tips, which you know, I really like them. And I got the same on my toes. Yeah, no, she can't be just a bit simple sometimes. Very Lana Del Rey of me. And I've not had red almond before. I've had red uh, tapered square French tips, but not almond. But I've got to go to the Trafford Centre now because stupid Jake forgot his mum's birthday. So I've got to go and get a present ASAP. It's not far from my nail appointment though. It's just 15 minutes out. So I said I'll go. I just hope it gets done quick. I want to go home now. Cold. It's like these days are being long. I've been jam packed. Got the goods. Got the goods. I went in, we were getting a sailing day, the, le the, rep the replica, the replica perfume. Went in, I'm like, we've got a sailing day. He's like, oh no, we don't stop that one. I'm like, oh, I knew this had happened. So I ring Jake, I'm like, what should I do? It's out of stock. So I get, so I just asked one of the popular ones. We stood there, I'm um and ah for about five minutes, what to do? And I go up to her and I go, what, what's another popular one that she might like similar to sailing day or beach walk and she goes did you say sailing day she goes, oh yeah we've got sailing day so, oh, so she didn't even look properly oh, i'm absolutely exhausted i'm so tired i really haven't got the energy to do my heatless curls but gotta do what you gotta do i bet you any money when my fire hits that pillow i won't be tired anymore just want to stay in bed forever for a thousand years look at this nonsense me and Jake went to Aldi the other day for lemonade we came out with three different types of lemonade Fucking, what else did we come out with strawberry pencils and a mini fire extinguisher because we both thought it would be a cool prop for the house and also well when do you not need a fire extinguisher? I've always wanted one. I need a bit of safety. I always think about what would I do in a fire. Oh, I just have to throw a bucket of water. How long does it ta how long does it take to find a bucket and then fill it up? If we don't get this house now, I'm gonna be stuck with a load of shit. <laughs> right, gotta go home now, tidy everything up because my friend Joel is coming round and I am dyeing his hair to match mine but with like a funky design in it. He's got a buzz cut. I've always wanted to do it so I'm going to film it. I was going to match it to my makeup but I don't think I'll have enough. I don't know. I might have enough time. It's coming at 11. It's quarter past eight. I'm going to tell my mum we bought a fire extinguisher but I'm like everyone has one. Hello. Hello. Not awake yet. Yeah. Look what I've got. Yeah. Fantastic. What's that for us? House fire extinguisher. Everyone has a fire extinguisher in the house, don't they? I haven't got one. You haven't got one? No, where are you going to put it? What if the fire starts up in the lot in the top bedroom and it's in the kitchen? I have to run really fast. You know that fire extinguishers are for specific things like some are for, some are for fire, some are for um, sort of electric fire. What's that one for? This is for fire. Oh, any fire. This is a fire extinguisher. A fire. Yeah. Any fire in the world? Yeah, there's this one. Why are you doing it like a baby? Because my fire extinguisher, baby, is going to save my life. Where are you going to put it? <coughs> right by where there's going to be a fire. Exactly. I'm dusting that off, Joe. No. I'm going to put it next to the kitchen for when Jake cooks. I'm going to have to sort this shit all out if I'm having guests. Right, we're all tidy. It's a good job I asked him to come at 12 and not 11. It's bang on 11 now. I need to decide on what TikTok sounds I want to use. I need to potentially start some makeup. I wanted to do my hair to match his hair to match my makeup. I don't know if I'll have enough time, but... Uh, and I've to sort the bathroom out, remove all the towels, put dry towels in there, get all my direction stuff out. I'm just gonna pick a sound now and then we should be good to go. Organise for once. 
got the scruffy towels, got a little apron, got the dye ready, tripod chair, taking out all my nice towels so I don't get anything on them. We need a light. Round number two, look at the colour of this. If my hair bleached to that colour, I'd be, I'd, be in, I'd be in trouble. We got it as far as red, but then he needed to go for his appointment. I need to shave it anyway, so it's... um. It needs to be a bit shorter to get a sharper line, but that's all right, because it gives me more time to do my... Uh, well, I'll finish this bit, but I can just finish my makeup while he's gone. I'm gonna have some noodles. My mango shoes have finally come. The last pair, these kept being sold out. Oh. Now, I wasn't sure about the dolly shoe trend. I was not, but I've been sucked in. I don't, I don't like the ones with the heel. They're not for me, not for me, but these I can get on board with. They've got little studs as well. Oh, they're so cute. Always wanted to be a ballerina as well. Maybe one day, if I have loads of money and I don't have anything else to do, I'll be a ballerina. Whoa! The final packet. Yeah, you know? I'll sit on your knee whilst I look. No, I don't want you to. <laughs> no, I'll sit on your knee and we can look together, yeah? I don't want to look it. I don't want to. Am I heavy? Yeah, you fat. <laughs> she said, I weigh, a, I weigh a ton, I stink of garlic and I'm horrible. <laughs> Oh, horrible stink. Makeup's done. Do you know what? I enjoyed doing this one. It was only simple. Well, <laughs> kind of simple. Uh, but yeah, I didn't actually want to die doing this one. So maybe I should just do more simple looks because I'm just not enjoying makeup at the minute. Is that my hair? God. Where is it and how do I get it off? Right, Joel's on his way back now. So we'll finish that and then we are done. What the fuck's going on? We're trying to do hair in here. Done. This is the last few bits that are going over. Mom, yeah. come and have a look at Joel's hair. Turn to the back so she can see. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reck? <laughs> that took ages. Well, longer than I thought it would. Classic me picking a design that I just think, oh yeah, that's fine, but. Getting the symmetry right on that, pain in the ass. I hope he actually likes it, because it hurt him. Obviously, I had to bleach it twice because his hair's dead dark, and then just all the dyes, just a lot. <laughs> I hope he likes it. Yeah, what a long day. Right, I'm going to Jake now. I have some chocolate buttons. I'm gonna do more accounting. More, I need it all done and perfectly ready to hand in on the 4th of April. I've already handed most of it in, but I'm like keeping up with it. Morning. There is, um, there's a song called Vogue. I found it on TikTok the other day. I don't know who the artist is. I think it's pronounced Noise, Noizu, something like that. It's got such a good beat, but the lyrics are just annoying. I hate the phrase, it's giving. It's get. why the fuck is it everyone saying it? I find it so irritating. It's giving this. It's not fucking giving anything. Fuck off. So it just say, it says it's giving all the way through that song, but it's, so, it's just such a catchy song. And it's such, it got such a good beat. So, yeah, I still like it. I just wish it didn't say fucking it's giving all the way through it. Anyway, I've got my Botox top up appointment today at Therapy Clinic, Trafford Centre. Sick of going to the Trafford Centre, I can't get rid of that place. And then I'm meeting my friend Chloe after it. Not Chloe, my normal Chloe. Chloe, Chloe with a C. Rainbow Chloe. Chloe that I went to Lapland with Chloe. Okay, I'm ready. I've got my stuff to take back to Primark. And I've got a few outfits to take pictures of Chloe. Three outfits each. Oh, and the sun's come out as well, which I'm absolutely buzzing about because it was raining before. I'm also late, so I need to hurry the fuck up. Well, that was nice and quick and easy, and I returned. It was literally two injections, and then I returned my crappy Hello Kitty Primark stuff. Um, but oh God, I already like I like these tops, but I don't like wearing them because I'm so insecure about my arms. I don't like my arms. I just think they just look. God, they just look awful. I just want to lose weight on my arms. They're just so. Oh. But I wear it anyway because I like these tops and then I just, I sat in the waiting room and I saw my arms in the mirror and I went, oh, 
you know when you don't feel that bad then you look at something and you're just like great just confidence goes completely down and not even brought a jacket so I was just thinking about it the whole time I was walking through the traffic center I was just thinking oh, to say I've got such loud confident I've got red pants on a red bag such loud confident image I just I'm so not like that really I don't know I am and I aren't but I was just looking into my phone and I was just thinking everyone's looking at me everyone's looking at your fat arms obviously no one's looking at my arms but I just I don't like them just feel like oh i need I just need to go to the gym I, need, I, I keep indulging it's fine you can just have a balanced life jenna but i'm just not good at it just not good at it i need to be good at it i need to go to the gym i am going to rudy's today because <laughs> chloe's never been to rudy's before what is that so obviously we've got to go but after that i'm going to the gym because i don't want to not feel confident this summer just all goes to my arms my legs are like pigeons legs i'd rather the weight go i like a big leg Whoa. i'd rather my weight go to my legs i don't want it on my arms I mean, fair, fair enough if that's what you like that's great it's fine for you but me personally before i get some shit for it me personally i just don't like it on me oh i just remembered actually someone stopped me and said you look absolutely gorgeous i said thank you so much because i don't feel it no i just need to have a balanced diet and go to the gym i can still eat good stuff i just need to stick to it and i just need to do it now because i'm not happy i'm not happy hello you look so oh we've made a friend <laughs> oh she's so cute we just went in that bookshop then because apparently people get pictures in there but that would just have been way awkward it was awkward so I'm just trying to find cute locations down for pictures. See my stories when I'm <laughs> She just said she hides a BT from seeing her story when she's eating. Like, I'm like, you can't believe this is your first Rudy's. She's copied my order. We found our Rudy's now, we're just getting changed into a different outfit in the toilet. And this this toilet is out of order. Will you give me any grief? Somebody's waiting to get into It's out of order. It's literally raining and we've both got some Oh you've taken yours off. Oh. Snake. Yeah. Snake. I felt silly. <laughs> <laughs> look at me look at me we're going to uh blank street because she wants to try the obviously she wants to try the blueberry matcha oh wait have you tried it yeah i love it it's really nice. you love it out of 10 it's great it's, it's like it's a strong 8.5 <laughs> we're done we had a really nice catch up i enjoyed just seeing chloe and talking we didn't really get pictures because i felt shit about myself and chloe was hungover and it just oh. No, it's hard. It's, it's hard when you see all these people in, like, say, like, influencers and stuff, and they've got these nice pictures in coffee shops or nice pictures in front of this, that, and the other. And you look at it and you think, oh, that's a cute picture. I'll do that. That's fine. You get there, and it's so scary. Like, Chloe wanted a picture in Blank Street, and just like, even me taking the picture, I was like, oh, people are looking, people are looking. She's like, people are looking, people are looking. It's hard. It's really hard. I hate taking pictures, actually scary and especially when you don't feel good about yourself but it's fine it's fine i didn't even we didn't even change into the third outfit because we just weren't feeling it but it was nice to catch up i'm glad we've done it i just need to i'm gonna go home and walk my dog i'm gonna go to the gym and i'm gonna do my finish my accounting once and for all tonight oh i feel terrible as well i i do not borrow things from my mum's wardrobe i just don't i don't like this i'm sorry but for a mum yeah sound but i wouldn't wear any of her stuff there's this one jacket that i do like this stradivarius jacket and i don't have anything like it and i wore it i brought it as one of part of one of my outfits i just didn't even think i get a phone call do you know where my stradivarius jacket is you go i'm like oh fuck i've got it on i've got it on and she's going out no <laughs> why did he he looked he didn't look dodgy or anything he was like very well dressed asking me to wind the window open and i did it and he took too long to speak and i was just like no i'm driving on and he was like oh, oh what he wanted right anyway yeah i've got a coat on that she was gonna wear for a work night out so i feel terrible about it i just 
I didn't think for a second, that wasn't to me by the way, I didn't think for a second she was going to wear that and I just feel awful about it, I felt awful about it all day now because she'd planned her outfit around that coat, that jacket. I just need to get to the gym and sweat everything out. Carter! Carter! I've gone insane. It's just one of them days where your mood goes from bad to worse. I um, I locked all the doors. I've taken Carter out, locked all the doors. He's just at home now. He's had his tea and everything. He's fine. He's in his bed. He's waiting for people to get home though. I'm going to the gym. Um, but yeah, he's in on his own. And I literally watched the garage door shut. I watched it with my eyes. And then I drove off and I was like, oh my God. I know I saw it shut, but did it shut? Did it shut? So I, I drove, I drove back. My mind was just like playing tricks on me. I was like, I know I watched it, but I don't think I did. Oh, oh. I'm ready for bed. May have had a cry this morning. I'm not one to complain if I don't get invited on brand trips or just events for a brand, but it, because I always know there's the girls that go deserve it so much and they, they're usually ones that have put their like, heart and soul into the brand. Well, not usually, but a lot of the time. I just know they've earned it more than me, so I wouldn't have a problem with it. But it's really a kick in the teeth when there's a brand that does a trip and you, or you just promote them to the death, organically paid. And also you can see how many sales you've made for them. And it's a fucking lot and you're just not considered or involved it actually really hurt my feelings that and i don't want to look like i'm just spitting my dummy out um because i'm not invited but it just feels pretty shit like to know how much effort you put in and it just feels like it's not been seen really like maybe i just don't fit the brief i do feel that often like got red hair outrageous hair swear a lot not like i don't want to say copy and paste because i just think that's really rude that's what people were saying about people at the pink honey event like they're just copy and paste girls well not they're not just copy and paste girls just because they look a certain way doesn't mean i think it's really rude to call them copy and paste because they're all beautiful girls and i think they look great but i get that i don't fit into that category i don't think i do I'm just like, is that why? Is that why? Or is it? I don't know. I don't know if I'm just thinking about it too much, but I don't know. It's just like putting all your effort into something and just feeling like it's not noticed. It just would have been nice to have been considered. I'm gonna go to the gym, I'm gonna do something for myself. Just sat in the gym car park, crying like a weapon so shit when you've got to just turn off tears and go in somewhere and act like normal um we'll leave it there i'll just remember where my loyalties are for future is that the correct phrase um and i'll just put my heart and soul into people that put it give it back and i'll also try harder the correct approach i like to think i'm an open book all the time and i'm always very honest so i hope this was honest enough for you because i need a really good gym song to change this mood around look at the tan on my forehead it's so patchy look at all the hairs this is so ew, this is so hd I didn't do loads today, but it's a start. I feel better for going. It was just so busy that you could barely get on anything. So I was kind of limited. And then I, I always get a bit shy when I go downstairs because so many men being men. <laughs> uh, there's this guy just doing everything with his top off and I just thought, is there any need? Imagine if I went around the gym with my top off just doing stuff. <laughs> Funny. Right. I'm just going to do things to make me feel good. I'm going to go now. I'm going to get some yoghurt so I can start making my smoothie bowls again. I love them. I love them so much. It's just they make you so cold. You're eating, basically eating ice cream, frozen stuff. So it just 
oh, it's too cold in this country to eat them every morning. And I'm gonna go and spy on my house because it's gonna be my house. And I need, to, well, and I need to post a parcel that's near it. So, but I'm gonna go and look at my house because I feel like some, I need some uplifting. Yeah, and then I'm gonna spend a really nice day with Chloe and we're gonna be healthy girls and we're gonna have fun together because I feel like I think Chloe's feeling a bit down too. So it's fine. I'm gonna wash my hair, I'm gonna have a nice bath, doing good things. The sun's come out, fuck it, fuck it. Do you know what's a funny little story? I just seen um, a little Molly Maid car drive past and when I was younger, my mum, because she's an evil witch, she thought, she'll try and taunt me and she'll say that there's a maid that's coming to look after me and mummy's going away <laughs> and she said that she was like molly maid's gonna come and look after you I, I don't know where she said she was going and she thought i'd be devastated <laughs> and i made molly made a card i was like can't wait to meet you can't wait for you to look after me and mum's like bloody hell <laughs> she wanted me to be sad that she was going and i was just buzzing <laughs> Dickhead. Oh, I've not seen the sold sign in person. Sold. Really hope it all goes well. Sold. Can't wait to show you it. It will all go well. It will all go well. I keep saying it. If it all goes well. No, it will. It will. From Acai Bowl. Dungeon food. Thanks. <laughs> For not here. I'm making a gorgeous mini egg cheesecake. Oh, it's actually. I've just tried the mixture. Me and Chloe have just tried the mixture. So delicious, guys. So delicious, guys. It looks gorgeous. It tastes like the Smarties pop-up ice cream. If anyone ever had them. Oh, it's bloody heavy. We're making... Shake smoke, powder, bag of tips. Um, <laughs> these are for meal prep. They're not just for me and Chloe. And then, tennis them rock. I've never made fish in my life. Well, I made fish, but actual you know, pieces of fish. Wait, have I even made fish? Don't know, so I hope it's all right. <laughs> Look at the state of that. It looks like a cauldron, a broth. It said you had to cook it in milk. When my mum cooks it in milk, though, she puts the tiniest amount. It, it said to cover the fish, but the fish ain't even fucking covered. So excited! I've actually been craving this little smoked young, young man of a fish. <laughs> I have. Oh, a vlog inside a vlog, look. Except nobody fucking watches mine. I like that shirt she's got on. So it's nice and that, doesn't she? Me and my companion. Oh, stop licking your tits and that while I'm like showing, showing the vlog. Me and the girl. Look at her. She's just sat with me like an hour fast asleep on me. Just a sleepy nugget, aren't you? Oh, I hit the clown. Oh, girl time is so fun. So fun. I really enjoyed that tea as well. And it, and it was, it was a healthy tea. And it was really nice at the same time. So that's great. I'm such an old woman though. It's 20 past nine, I'm actually exhausted. Like I've had to go home because I am I need to get in bed right now. I didn't have a great night's sleep. That bloody idiot of a boy that I'm married to. He, um, in the night, he always does this, it does my head in. He, he'll wake up for whatever reason and all right, some people do wake up and check the phone. He doesn't just turn over and grab the phone, look at it. He sits up and gets the phone and looks at it, which wakes me up. It wakes me up and it keeps me up whilst he's up there because it lifts the covers up and it's just like, you're annoying me. And then he's on his e-cig and that sound infuriates me. And he just wakes me up and then I can't get back to sleep and then he'll put his phone down after like two minutes and he'll be like conked out and I'm like I'm awake now you dick <sighs> so then after that I just couldn't sleep for hours and then the fucking birds started tweeting and then he was snoring and I was like you shut up shut up and then there was some beeping noise I, after all that the snoring the tweeting the fucking puffing I was just getting to sleep and some beeping noise. And I was just like, what is that noise? <laughs> and then I woke up and usually we'll have a hug before we get up. Jake had already tried to sneak out. He said, I didn't want to, make, I didn't want to wake you up because you were so angry at me last night. <laughs> anyway, 
going for a nice walk today into the village. I'm gonna get a coffee or a hot chocolate if you may. Nice though, it's, it's a nice sunny day. I'm keen for that. It's rare that I can get Jake to go on a walk, so it's nice when he actually really wants to. Oh, I love a nice walk with Jake when the sun is shining. Do I look nice and fresh? That was the, um, the goal. SPF, face tan spray and brows. Oh, and my road lip tint and my new favorite joggers. And loads of body oil. like an actual summer's day it's lovely this is my favorite part going over the stepping stones although i swear they've got really like deep over the past few years i'm a bit scared of them now oh my god definitely dropping this road case in <laughs> wow this is so much fun we never do this this is like this is nice Got a nice little toasty ham and cheese. Yeah, as well. I've literally wanted to do this for a year. Come and get these skins because they're so nice. And then a so nice drink in the sun. Yeah. Sunny day the yeah, thanks. No, I asked you all last year. No, you <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> these occasions with a garlic well, you dip. Woke up at 9 a.m. Shut up. Kicked you out of bed. This was a last minute idea. This is pretty awful, that. This is awful. <laughs> I can feel it's, it. It's horrible. Oh no, why is it doing that? Oh god, that's all. It looks really angry. You alright, Jay? You look very nice, both of you walking along. Very trendy. I had a really nice morning. Right, I need to go home now. I need to finish the mini egg cheesecake. I'm dying to eat that. I think it's going to be really nice. And then I've got to eat whatever cremated piece of old boot my mum's made. <laughs> I can't wait to make my own Sunday roast and just do it like why like why are the older generation why do they just cremate me what's the point in killing something if you're just gonna cremate it that genuinely is a waste of a life leather leather out boot it looks good doesn't it it's not flush to the edges but it's okay that's okay. Got my little chicks on top. That was good. It looks just like a giant smarty pop up. Grandma, Grandad, what do you think? Are you impressed with what I've made for you? I am very impressed. Yeah. Absolutely Would Jesus beautiful. approve? I don't think so. No, it looks good. On the it looks good. Cheese. <laughs> I don't think you've ever been able to do this. Oh! <laughs> Are we all tucked in, ready to go back home. Let me, yeah. It's, it's you were, what? On it. I know it's my phone. Oh. It's my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Smashed it. She got out the car in under twenty seconds. She's an absolute pro now. Bye. Bye. Hope oh, they got the bloody keys. The clocks go forward tonight. It's gonna be bright every day now. And it's fine because we don't have to get up tomorrow so we don't miss an hour of sleep, so it's all good. This is 100% the best present I've ever bought for Jake. They're so relaxing, the stars. I wonder if we'll have to get a better one when we move out because the room will be bigger. And it's only some cheap thing off Amazon. Happy Easter, my pumpkin princesses. Why, oh, one of my eyebrows is really offset. This one's gone higher up now. Shit. Um, I have to, I've not edited my vlog all week, so I need to sit here right now and edit it. Luckily, Jay's got some work to be doing, so I can do that. I'm going to go to the gym, and then we've got Easter, Sunday. Meal number two at Jake's house with Jake's family. Finished my vlog, great stuff, all caught up. Now we're going to the gym. She's put more Botox in that eyebrow because that one was higher up. And now this one's higher up. This is the only one that goes up. <gasps> now I just look like I'm questioning everything. And I had a ball patch there on my eyelashes, which is great because it's going back now, but then I've got a ball patch there. It's always this eye, I don't, I don't know what to do. I must rub it more or something. But this eyelash is fine. Obviously it looks pretty shit now, but once I 
re-perm them. They'll look way better because they're growing out, but it's just forward so you can't see them, but. This is what Jake eats for tea. <laughs> Whoa, guess who's that one is? <laughs> beige for a beige princess. We're just hiding the children's eggs now. Where's the other one? We need one more hiding spot. This is egg number two. I think that's a pretty good spot. And then this is the last one. but I didn't get a very good egg return this year. I'm actually upset that people are thinking I'm too old for it. I'm like, I'm granny got me an egg. Jake got me an egg, didn't you? Very you got sweet. The wrong one. Got me the wrong one. I I yeah, explicitly yeah. said it because I went and got my granddad the cookie crumble galaxy one from. I failed at egging. I did say, I said, look, if there's an egg you want to get me, this is the one I really, really want this egg. I love this yeah, egg. you didn't explicitly say this is the one I don't want. So. Uh, oh, Jake, look, I held this egg and I was like, look, I'd lo if you want to get me one, this is the one. I love this one. So Jake took that and thought, not going to get her that. And he got me a lint one, but I don't like lint chocolate. I'm so sorry. It was so sweet, but it's so sickly. Oh, but, oh don't, don't do this. Buddy. I got you. Well, I got him a milky bar so one. Expensive. Shut up! Shut up! Stop it now! You should have listened to what I said. Either pounds. I'll send you the fifteen pound. No, stop this now! You even agreed that you should have just listened to me. I love it. Thank you so much. I just crushed my onion rings. <laughs> they were all I had. They were all I had. My egg return this year was two eggs. And all the kids got like 16. Yeah, I've got them keys. I bought six eggs. I bought six eggs this Easter. And I got two in return. I bought four and got none, so. Who did you, bought four? Who did you buy the three others for? One for you. Yes. William, Eliza. Are you taking the piss? I paid for them. You bought one egg. We're watching this because apparently Jake says it's won loads of Oscars, but it is two and a half hours long. Jake, I can handle I'm two. Gonna, I can handle I'm two and a half hours. This but it's, 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 it's <laughs> <laughs> my tiny little four-inch dick. <laughs> it is late for a two and a half hour, half hour film. Half hour film. Oh my eighteen-year-old little mind can handle your tiny little two and a half inch hour film. <laughs> well, we got. 17 minutes 38 in. Fucking, I hate it. I, it, was, it was upsetting. It was upsetting. They, it was upsetting. they just squashed a frog then and I thought, well, that's it. That's too much. It was it's just awful. Weird. It was making me feel sick. I don't know, no, I don't know what about it was fish. making me feel sick, but I just time. do not like that film. I don't know what awards it's won. Dickhead award, but I'm not interested. Shazzy's film with you. Award. <laughs> Oh no, we've decided to keep it on and it's actually, it's not as bad once you, but it is still very weird. At least it's got some colour now. I don't mean to be that girl, but I do prefer, I prefer a filming colour. Oh, hang on, it's the end of the week. I hope everyone's had a lovely week and a, and a lovely Easter. And this film, it's not actually that bad, it's just fucking weird. I'll see you next week.